Hi, welcome back uh, to a new tutorial. Today we make a skirt for a girl. Uh, it is a fast and short tutorial, but it's not evil. So we add mesh, a circle, 32 is okay. We see we have a tier. And now we want to have uh, each segment is uh, selected. So we go here to checker deselect. You see now each one, when we go here, every second one, and so on. We want two to two, like that. Then uh, we go downwards with that whole thing. So that is later our rotten's there. Then we uh, get the whole thing with extrude and extrude them to the job. Scale set zero. Uh, bring them down to. Then we plug their um, subdivision surface on and you see what happens now we have the skirt. We give them a level two. That is better. Uh, you can get the effects uh, harder when you make here some two. So that means when we extrude here and get the middle loop there, there we can make this selection again. Check it, deselect, and uh, can uh, scale them in the middle. Then you got more this skirt effect that we search. Then we can do, we make here a loop in and rotate them in the, in the set. Rotate set. We might make it scale set zero. Then we rotate set. So now you can make there some variations in that it flows better to the rest. Uh, you can scale it, you can say here it should be smaller, higher, you can tweak them as you want. That's a good part on the thing. You can make it higher, lower, a long skirt, a short skirt or something else. When you want to make the materials on, we must uh, unwrap that so we can here mark seam the top and the down part mark seam and one line at the back where well, we don't see that that is the best to unwrap this model so we can take a note editor get that here back get here an uv then we take the whole thing in edit mode and unwrap that that is our skirt now uh, then we can get there a new material. We take an image and we get there some flowers or something else. So I look here what I have. Here I have some flowers. Uh, so we have a skirt with flowers. Uh, wonderful. You also can make there then a belt on. So. Um, with Shift D, you can make a copy, P, uh, separate the selection, then you have that uh, that belt there. Then you can say here should be round. That means you can take the loop tools circle, and you see then you have that directly. You can now give them a thickness with uh, a solidifier. Then you see you got a thick version of that. Then you can give them other material like a leather or something else. And then we go here to leather and we give them a brown. Wow, that's not what we want. Uh, so we go here 
and give them material zero, use nodes, and image, and this flower thing here. Oh, that here. So if you want the flowers uh, lower or something else, um, we must make it here in nodes. Uh, that means when we add um, uh, coordinates for the textures and um, mapping for them, we connect UV with vector and um, the vector with vector. Then we can say texture. And here's the scale of this texture from flowers. If I take a five, you will see they are less. And if I take a point three, and here point three, then we have a fine detailed one. Yep. Uh, that is good for now. Um, the thing you can do is this um, uh, belt here. I said it before. Uh, there's the same. Uh, it is too rough in the moment, so you can take the same things here. Mark that with right, hold shift and mark that with right. Uh, control C to copy that. Go to the material letter and control V to input that. Let's copy paste. It works there too. And now you see it is much uh, better. You can take it point one if you want. That is very fine. So you have the belt for that, and you give, can give them all materials like you want. That is a skirt in minutes, so have a lot of fun with that. Uh, wish you a nice day. See you in the next tutorial. And you can take it as a lamp. Yeah, <laughs> when you make a lamp in there, you have a lamp too. Wow. It's that cool. Good. Bye.